All right, guys, so we're over here at my computer, and we're going to get started on how to build an SEO agency website in one hour. All right, so most likely you have the video playing here on your screen. Uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to close out this video for a moment, and we're going to open up two other windows so that you guys can work simultaneously um, with us as we go through this tutorial here. All right, so um, so in just a second, I'm going I'm to show you guys right here what you're going to want to do. You're going to want to close out the video window and then click on your SEO agency WordPress theme and click on Bluehost. Okay, and so as I do that, you'll see you're not actually purchase anything, but it's going to just open two windows on your desktop. Uh, the first one for Bluehost, uh, you know, you got to have hosting for your website. And then the second one is going to be uh, where we're going to buy our WordPress theme. All right, so go ahead and do that right now. Close out the window, click on these two links, and then come back to the spot in the video. We'll give you guys a second to do that, and then we'll continue. All right, guys, so hopefully you made it back um, to the spot in the video that you currently were. All right, so first things first, what we're going to do here is we're going to buy our WordPress premium template. Okay, and basically a, a WordPress template, this is what your website is actually going to look like when it's done. Okay, it's um, it's called the SEO WP theme, and it's just this incredible uh, WordPress template that uh, s sells for fifty dollars. And what's awesome though is that it's really a steal because it comes with all these photos, and it comes with all this text already added in for you. So so literally in about twenty minutes from now, we're gonna have this site uh, looking just like this for you, uh, up and running. Um, and you're going to have your own really, really professionally looking site. And so as I scroll down here, this theme comes with all these images where, you know, normally you'd have to uh, buy those separately from a stock image place. Uh, again, all the nice, all the nice images and icons, you know, you, when you hover over different buttons, they light up. You got the scrolling of different client logos and testimonials. Uh, but really, really clean looking theme here that's very, very professional looking. This is the type of brand image that you want to give off. The first impression that you want your clients to see is that it, you know this looks like a professional agency's website here. Okay, uh, so yeah, this is the theme we're going to build out. Uh, let's get started on that right now. So if you go over to one of those windows that we opened up, uh, we're here at Theme Forest. And what you're going to want to look for here is called the the SEO WP theme. Okay, so it's the SEO WP theme. This is the very first WordPress theme here. You see, you got the purple icon. It says, um, you know, we love Alina. What's really awesome is that for every one of these WordPress themes purchased, they're donating a portion. Um, to uh, to save uh, this woman Alina's life, who who's having some uh, some health problems right now. Uh, so again, you're supporting an awesome cause. Okay, but here's the actual WordPress theme, and you can scroll down and see details about it. 1,600 people have bought this theme. Um, you know, it has a five star rating. So uh, you can click on live preview and look at the actual preview of the theme. But uh, basically, what you want to do is you're going to want to go ahead and click purchase. And then you'll go ahead and you'll check out and you'll purchase the theme. Go ahead and save. Uh, you know, after you purchase it, you'll be able to download the files to the theme. Go ahead and save all that good stuff on your desktop uh, for us to access later. So actually, I'm going to go ahead and, and check out now, and I'll, I'll blur some of this out as I go through the checkout process. But just to show you guys again how easy this is. I can get my password correct. Okay, all right, fifty dollars at checkout through PayPal. Okay, boom. So what you're gonna want to do next is you're gonna want to click download. Okay, let's go ahead and click the green button download. You know these files are gonna download onto your computer. Um, they're gonna be in a .zip uh, format. Okay, 
and uh, and you can see for us we actually have them downloaded right here okay so this file we now have on our desktop as a dot zip uh, if you right click on it you can click open open with and, and basically you're going to want to unzip this file so if you have a PC it might be you might have to do it something different but you want to unzip the file so that you have um, you know the different types of themes here um, this is the one we're going to want to in install whenever you install a WordPress theme it's always in a dot zip file so we're just pulling out this extra file leaving it on our desktop uh, we're going to go ahead and, and use that to install our theme uh, later okay all right, so yeah, now we have downloaded and paid for our WordPress theme. All right, that's uh, that part's done. So now click on the second uh, tab here. That's your Bluehost, and what we're going to do is we're going to sign you up for WordPress uh, for hosting. Okay, so there's monthly fees for your website to run on the internet uh, and to be up in the virtual cloud. That's called hosting. Uh, we're going to get you guys signed up with hosting right now. Uh, so here we over here we are at Bluehost.com. Now there's a couple of different things, you know, to start off with here. Uh, you can guys can go for shared hosting, and it starts at four dollars a month. Uh, what we're going to recommend you guys go for is at the top. You can see there's shared hosting. That's a little bit cheaper, um, but if you go with WordPress hosting, this is going to be best for you guys. I will tell you, but uh, tell you now, it's a little bit more. It's at twelve dollars a month. Comes out to something like forty cents a day. Uh, but the reason it it's uh, we recommend this is your site's going to run really 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 fast and you can also host five websites on here so that's not just for one as you build out websites for your clients or for anyone else you have four other additional sites under this hosting plan um, but this hosting is going to keep your website running fast it's also going to back up your website for you daily so as you learn WordPress and stuff should you make a mistake and and delete your site or delete something uh, you'll be able to bring it back so it's a nice little safety cushion we recommend you go with twelve dollars a month. Click select and then go ahead and sign up. Um, what happens is is the very next screen you're going to see it says sign up now and choose a domain. Okay, so this is where it gets kind of exciting. You guys get to obviously name your own company, um, but you need to pick out a do domain name that's going to help you guys rank in the search engines. Okay, so think about it for a moment. Decide if your strategy is going to be to go into a cer certain vertical uh, market or if you're going to go after optimizing for uh, your particular city okay so let's just say you live in, in um, uh, Minnesota you maybe you want to be on the first page of, of Google for Minnesota SEO uh, for people that are looking for your service uh, so what you can do is you can type in what you would like your domain to be minnesotaseo.com and click next Bluehost is going to let you know if that domain is available or not. We know right now that, uh, oh, I have spelled Minnesota wrong because I know that this domain is not available. Two ends. Okay, so not available for registration. It's going to give you guys some alternatives. Minnesota SEO Group, uh, Minnesota SEO Online. So. You know, that's if you are going to optimize for your city and SEO. Who knows? Maybe you are uh, leaving your accounting day job and you have an expertise in accounting. You might be doing SEO and internet marketing for the accounting vertical. All right. So maybe your domain you want your domain name to be accountingseoexpert.com. Um, you know, you can go ahead and check out that domain. See if that's available. Uh, let's actually go ahead and check this out. Okay, it's available. So once it's available, you go ahead, you fill out all your information here. You, uh, we'll tell you guys right now, you do not need domain name privacy. Okay, so get rid of that. Uh, Site Backup Pro, we do recommend that. That's the um, the backup. Uh, you don't need any of this other stuff, so don't let them upsell you on that. Go ahead, click Next, and you'll be all signed up. Okay. Now once you're signed up, you'll be into your Bluehost account. This is what this looks like here inside Bluehost. The next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to click install WordPress. 
So front and center, install WordPress. Again, you have a couple options here. Um, you know, Bluehost is offering a service where they do it for you. So if, should you have any trouble or you not want to do it yourself, you can pay a hundred dollars and they'll actually go ahead and, and install your theme and uh, and get your domain name set up. Uh, we're going to show you guys how to do it for free yourself. So you'd go ahead, you'd click install. You'd pick your domain name that you uh, that you bought. So maybe it was accounting SEO expert or maybe it was Minnesota SEO group .com. Make sure you go ahead and you actually choose the domain name that you, you want to optimize for um, and then click um, uh, you know check domain. It's going to go ahead and check the domain and make sure that you can go ahead and install WordPress on it. So that's what this is checking out right now. Okay, um, so one thing that we're going to do real quickly is uh, we're going to show you guys how to, and we'll we'll get right back there, how to buy a uh, a, a second domain name. So maybe you you didn't spend a lot of time looking for the domain name that you want to buy you can come up here to domains and again you can use this tool right here to search for other domain names okay so one thing that we're gonna do we're gonna buy this domain name to use for this example dynamic SEO uh, we'll do marketing.com Okay. Now, once you go ahead and you buy a secondary, uh, a second domain, you can click on domains, and here it is. It's unassigned, so you have to click it. To assign it. Okay, and then you're to come on. You're just going to scroll all the way down. It's going to be an add-on domain. All this is fine. Come on down. Click assign this domain. It's going to take a moment, but then you're, uh, you're, you'll have a second domain name that's assigned to your uh, hosting account here. So you have the primary one that you signed up for and then a secondary one. Uh, this is just to show you guys different options of domain names before uh, you go ahead and... Um, get signed up so you don't have to go with the primary domain name you can buy additional domain names and, and decide to build your WordPress on on any one of those okay uh, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pause this for a moment while this loads okay so after that went ahead and finished loading um, what we can do now is now we're gonna go officially and install WordPress so you click on install WordPress you click on the green button install Again, this is where you're going to choose which domain you want to build your SEO agency website on. Okay, so we're going to do choose this domain, dynamicseomarketing.com. Choose the one that you want in your account. Click check domain. Bluehost is going to go ahead and make sure the uh, domain is good to go and all set up. Uh, let's see. I like to check mark both these, so show advanced options. Now give this right here, site name, go ahead and name your site whatever your uh, business name is or domain name is. So for us, we're going to do dynamic SEO uh, marketing. Uh, and, and then what you're going to see here, you're going to have your username and password. Okay, so go ahead and write down your username and password on a piece of paper or otherwise uh, start a Word document where you keep all your logins. Okay, um, and then go ahead, uh, check mark the very, very bottom one, and click install now. So this is actually a really cool service. So what Bluehost is doing now is they're actually going to go ahead and install your WordPress theme. It's going to take about 10 minutes for them to do that. Again, we're going to come back. Um, you know, you'll get this screen here. It says your install is underway. You'll have this little bar at the top. Once that's all done, you'll actually get an email uh, letting you know that your installation is complete. And, uh, and so once you get that email, we'll pick up from there in the video uh, what you're actually going to do to go ahead um, and uh, install your WordPress theme. All right, guys, so our installation is complete. At the very top, you can click on View Credentials. All right, and you can just ignore all these uh, little pop-ups here. But then right here under Action, you can click View. 
All right, this is the information you're gonna to wanna to copy down. It's your website domain name, the admin URLs where you're gonna log into your WordPress site. All right, and, uh, and then your username and password. Okay, so go ahead, click on admin URL. It's gonna open up a, uh, another window for you. And this is what you're gonna see before you log into WordPress every time. Again, enter in your, your username and password. So we're gonna go ahead and copy this copy this over and once you're actually logged into your WordPress account then you can go ahead and uh, change your password around so that's not that string of numbers okay all right guys so now we're officially in the back end of our WordPress site okay now this is what uh, the back end of WordPress looks like it's uh, pretty easy to uh, understand we'll go through everything uh, before we do go ahead and if you take your your actual your new domain name and then you copy it you can open up a new window and you can see what your website currently looks like okay so it's, it's just a blank page right now it's nothing going on uh, dynamic SEO marketing.com that's gonna change once we install our WordPress theme Okay, so back inside the dashboard, uh, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to come over to Appearance on the left-hand side, and we're going to click Themes. Okay, so these are different free themes that WordPress offers you. Remember, we brought a premium theme, uh, so we're going to click on Add New Theme here. And at the very top, again, these are all free themes. Um, we're going to click on Upload Theme here at the top. Now this is where we're going to select the file from our website. And it's it, the file name should be Theme Forest, a string of numbers, social media and digital marketing agency dot zip. So you click Choose. And then you click Install Now. Again, this is just going to take a quick moment here, uh, but WordPress is going to go ahead and unzip the file. They're going to install the theme, and if we did everything correctly in about 30 seconds here, that blank page, this you know blank, uh, what our website currently looks like, is going to look like the actual demo site of um, that we showed you guys earlier. So, uh, pretty awesome how quickly you can have that turned around, but. Again, this is still loading, so we'll give it a moment and we'll come back. We'll pause this tutorial. We'll come back to you guys in a second once this has loaded for us. All right, guys, so what we're going to do next, we're going to install our theme. So click on Appearance and Themes. All right, and so these are free WordPress themes that, uh, you know, that uh, WordPress offers you, but we bought that premium theme that, that looks real sharp. So click Add New Theme. Okay, and then at the very top, click Upload Theme. Okay, so we're going to choose this file from our computer, and it was actually called, uh, let's see, it was called SEO WP underscore theme installable dot zip. That's the file you want to choose. And then you're going to click Install Now. All right, so this theme's going to go ahead and upload and install onto your WordPress site. Again, this is what your site looks like right now. It's just blank slate, nothing going on, the Hello World post. But as soon, you know, in a matter of about five, six minutes here when this theme is done, and there it's already finished installing. Uh, once it's finished installing, click Activate. Okay, now once it's... Uh, okay. All right, guys, so then the very next thing you're going to do here is you're going to click Install Required Plugins. And what's awesome about this premium theme is it came with about 10 plugins that sell for about $15 each. So you're getting a huge deal buying this theme uh, with all the bundled plugins. But go ahead and click this top box here. And what it's going to do is going to check mark all of these uh, plugins that you're going to want to have installed on your site. And then under this drop down menu here, click Install and then Apply. Okay, so what that's going to do, it's going to install all of those WordPress plugins for you for free. 
uh, in just a couple seconds here. All right, so our computer is going to go ahead and load. It's going to install all those plugins. Just give this a second more. Okay, so once that's finished installing and loading, you get the check mark there. Go ahead and click Integrate Installed Plugins. That's going to take just a second. You'll get a check mark there when you're done. All right, bam, got the check mark there. Go ahead, click the third one, import all demo data. Now this is actually really cool. All the demo content is gonna give you all the images and all the text that you saw literally in the demo site. So as soon as this number three is done loading, our website is gonna be essentially built out. And the only thing left to do is gonna be for us to go in there and kind of make the content unique to our own company and to our, our own business. Um, you know, that's it's really important that you have unique content. So it's good to have the demo content in there so you can understand when you make edits to your site, you know, what's changing where and you can kind of get an idea of, of what to say in certain spots of your site. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and change all that up. But guys, this is the last step right here. As soon as this is done uh, importing, the very next thing for you to do is go up here and click on visit website. Okay, so wait till this is done loading, click on visit site, and you're going to see that your entire website is already built out for you on your domain name. You're set to go. Okay, so go ahead afterwards, watch the quick tour if you feel like getting a interactive demo uh, from the, um, the WordPress theme makers themselves. But that's it for the installation setup of um, WordPress and your new WordPress theme and hosting. That was literally the hardest part of building your own website. We just got done through it in about 21 minutes here. And so the rest of the videos are just gonna be the fun part is gonna be us customizing your site to look, feel, and say the things that you want. All right, so that's it for this first video. We'll go ahead, we'll see you in the next video where we get into making those other changes.